we are told Wu Zetian was ruthless in her reign. Now, archaeologists are unearthing new evidence from Wu's era that may at last challenge this version of her story. <laughs> Professor Cheng Jianlin is the world's leading archaeologist of the Tang era. <laughs> Historian Dr. Harry Rothschild has heard about some intriguing tomb figurines of women found recently that date to Wu's reign. Whoa. It's amazing seeing all these Tang artifacts. I've been studying Wu Zhao, Wu Zetian, for 17 years. And finally, here we are at, at, at ground zero. You, know, you can censor everywhere uh, here in Chang'an. The figurines depict Chang'an's musicians, traders, and nobility. They are buried alongside the dead to ensure a wealthy afterlife, and they give clues to what changed in society during Wu Zetian's era. Here we can see a lady riding on a red horse going on a trip somewhere. That shows women are free to do things in that society at that time. Here we can see that there is another fashion, which is a lady wearing men's clothes. It is because at that time women can do everything that men do, like riding, hunting or traveling. During Wu Zetian's period, women's standing became higher than ever before. Wu had ensured that during her reign, it was a good time to be a woman in China, and that freedom to flourish went to the very top of her court. She surrounded herself with women, including appointing a female prime minister 